YouTube. My name is Ruben Fernandez, the dog from Rookie Scene. And today, <clears throat> the purpose of this video is to let you know about this RDA that I have. This is the uh, Velocity Style RDA, which I bought from fasttech.com for, I believe it was like nine or ten dollars. And uh, let's vape it and see how it works, how much vapor it produces. So here we go. So, uh, starting with this video, it's um, like it's something that I want to tell you or to let you know about this RDA. I mean, I have several ones, uh, several other RDAs like uh, the uh, Mutation X version 4. Here it is, it's mounted on my Hades. And uh, I also have another one, I have the uh, Derringer. This one, it's mounted on a mod that I made myself. See, this is the Derringer. And uh, I have others, including tanks, like, like this one, the uh, Triton, I guess, from Aspire, mounted on my Sigeli 50 watts. But the purpose of this video is to let you know the pros about this uh, RDA the velocity style RDA so let's dive down and take a closer look about this RDA okay so here we have my mod it's an IPB it's an IPB3 LI and I have on this one mounted my velocity style RDA this RDA it's way cooler than the other halves that I, that I have, right? I'm mean, not going to show you why. I mean, if we open this one, here you can see that it has a double post. This is the positive. This is the positive, as you can see here the uh, insulator. Then this is the negative, and it has four holes two on this side and two on the other ones I'm not able to show you the holes because I have my build and well at least you can see the uh, the uh, screws here there's one here and one over here same as the other one the juice well it's quite deep it has like about four millimeters in depth there you have it it has double O, double O rings here to ensure the cap. I mean, it stays. Uh, it's 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 tight, as you can see. Okay, no falling. And this RDA, it's made out of four parts, which is the base, and you can disassemble or take apart out of this. This is the uh, whiteboard drip tip. As you can see, it's really wide, and you can have, I mean, sorry, you have the, uh, this is the air control flow, and this is the the, uh, the one that they attach to the base. So, these are the four parts for the uh, Velocity Style RDA, I'm sorry for the light, but they have a, a crappy camera. So this is the uh, velocity style RDA, and uh, it comes with the it comes with this. Uh, let me show you. <coughs> this is the box. It came on this box, and it has some extra extra screws. Uh, it came with two coils. I already used one, and I believe it's a. Uh, it's like a 26 yeah like a 26 and it comes with this one this is the uh, 510 adapter in which the whiteboard drip tape goes attached to this like so and there you have it but if you and then you can put this one just like that and you can control your airflow here so that's with the whiteboard drip tip and 
you can take off the whiteboard drip tip and install this base here this is the uh, 510 adapter there you go it's made out of uh, Delrin I guess and you just put this thing here and you're able to mount any 510 drip tip so as you can see there this is the airflow control you can open up here's open the one the six holes that it has on this cap plus this one or you can close the holes by twisting it then you will have open only this one this 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 control here or you can totally close it up and there you go it's all close no bent you can open only those ones and the the other ones kind of are like the uh, cycle ones close but I really don't recommend that so so there you have it with all of the uh, holes open every single one of them I don't like to use this ones with this so I will take out take off the uh, the 510 drip tip adapter and I will put my white bore there you go drip tip now this one it's really easy to drip through the uh, through through the uh, white bore drip tip it's really easy because it's way too too open so I just want, want to show you something it has this little notch here uh, I don't know if you can see it it is well, where is this one over here I'm touching it this one here and that's for the reason or the purpose uh, well you align that thing with this it has this little notch here I don't, know, I don't think you're able to see it but I'm touching it here due to my crappy camera you're not able to see it let me see well it has this thing right over here that one aligns with that notch over there and that will help you there it clicks on now you can twist this without being worried of unscrewing your RDA to the mod it works really well I really do recommend it and uh, let's go back up so that we can talk a little bit more about it that's the uh, velocity style RDA uh, it is a really 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 great and well performed it has well performance great performance RDA I like it better than all of the other ones that I have it produces a lot of paper it is really easy to build on this RDA I mean maybe you can build it with your eyes with, with your eyes closed I mean I don't know it's super easy and it's uh, it has really really great quality build quality paint quality and everything it's made out of, out of uh, I don't know if it's steel or maybe it's aluminum I'm not sure but do I recommend this one sure yes I do recommend it I got it from fastech.com it cost me like nine something probably ten dollars the uh, shipping was super fast I got it here <coughs> I'm sorry I got it here in a week so I guess that's super fast and uh, I didn't pay for any shipping and handling I really like buying from Fastech they're not paying me anything I'm just doing this, this review because I really fall in love with this RDA and I really really like how they treated, treated me at Fastech.com so if you're thinking on getting one of these 
Yeah, sure. I do recommend it. It's totally awesome, totally great, super easy to build on, and it works great. There's really a lot of vapor, but I have my fan on and the air conditioning on. So, thank you for watching. Hope this video was at least a little bit helpful for you. And uh, go check it out at fastic.com. See you next time.